This is an open letter to all abusive men. And some of you men may see this and say, well, I'm not abusive. Maybe. Maybe you are. This is a PSA to let you know that you are not only hurting you, but you're hurting your family. You're not only hurting you, but you're hurting the world. And I, as somebody with a lot of fire, understand that we have, as men, have not been taught how to be with our feelings. And if we have been taught, it's, it's to, to, to act it out in, in forms of aggression with other boys when we pound up against each other and we express it that way. Well, what happens when you take somebody, a little boy who's five and he's taught that big boys don't cry and that, that he needs to suppress his feelings in some form or fashion because, you know, crying means you're weak or you're a sissy. That same five-year-old, by the time he's eight, has no clue what to do with those feelings. And by the time he's 15 and he's fighting in school and he's, and he's acting out in class, he has no clue how to, how to find those feelings within himself, how to activate those things. Because society still, to this day, it's all about courage, courage, and we're all courageous. Wrestling tigers and like jumping off a mountain. Men still, still, I get it guys, you don't have an outlet. There's no one there telling you that it's okay to feel what you're feeling. So let me go back to the, the, the 15 year old. Now that 15 year old is a 24 year old. And he's with someone who is in touch with her emotions. Why? Because little girls are taught that it's okay. Little girls are, 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 are rubbed and pet when they're crying and we hold them and we say, oh mama, it's okay, it's gonna be okay. We don't say, you don't cry. Big boys man up, they toughen up. It's a completely different come from. So it's no wonder that when men and women get in the same room and they get in intimate, vulnerable relationships that they, they bump up against each other because one has been taught emotional intelligence and the other has been taught to destroy everything in its path. You not only hurt you, but you hurt the people you love. You hurt them for a long time. You create scars, emotional scars, and damage within yourself, within your friends, within your family, within your loved ones. I offer this. The next time you feel that rage bubbling up, the next time you feel like, like you don't know what to do with it, just call a time out. Say, listen, I need at least five minutes to breathe and to see what's really here. I get it, it's not so simple in the, in the heat of the moment when you've been triggered and all that stuff is coming up to just stop. But call a timeout. Step away, take a few deep breaths and just, just assess what's there. And ask yourself, is this what I really want? This is Questions with Preston. I absolutely appreciate you. If you dig this message, if you think that you it should be shared with other men, please do so. I love you guys, I appreciate you. Live from Joshua Tree, I see you on the other side. At Preston Smiles on everything. I love you guys.